So now, uh, how do I insert? So the structure of insert will be very similar, will be very similar, okay? But now you need to replace, you need to replace the second argument, you need to replace the second argument with a reference to pointer. Now let's do an insert. So the structure of insert is the same. And uh, how do you want to design your insert? Insert should take an input parameter, right, of type Z. Okay, is it const or non-const? Non-const, non okay. My search is actually a const function, right? Maybe I want to change my search to a const function because searching is not going to alter your tree, right? But insert is a non-const. And again, I'm going to do the same technique. I'm going to use a, a private helper method. <coughs> so my helper uh, down here. And what do you want to do? You want to return Boolean or void? I'd say Boolean. Yeah. Boolean, in case you try to insert a duplicate. OK? <coughs> so let's say we don't want to allow duplicate. If you try to insert a duplicate, then you will say return false. OK? If the insert is successful, then you will return true. And uh, my private uh, function would be another Boolean insert. And uh, <coughs> it will take two parameters as before, key and uh, node pointer uh, position. <coughs> I just, I'm, I'm lazy to type longer variable name for now. Couldn't you, <coughs> couldn't you technically like combine <coughs> insert and basically do the same thing if they're definitely private? If you change the search function to return the node, you could reuse the code. Yeah, you could reuse it and use the function. Say that again? You could use uh, the search and insert functions could actually be inside of the same function. Just when you call search, um, you indicate that you don't want to insert when you're done. Um, but when you call insert, you indicate that but you But then, then your, I cannot, I cannot use cons for my search, right? Okay. <laughs> So remember, const correctness is an important concept in C++. Mm -hmm. Okay. So if you do that, if you merge the two functions, search and insert, into one, then we're going to have a problem because now you cannot declare your search to be a const. Okay. Right. Okay. Can you just make search return a node though? Yeah. If you have search return a node, then the search. Uh, public function and just compare that node to the key. Okay, if you want to change that to a return a note, I agree. So we can do that. When I'm reviewing the video, I just realized that it's not a good idea to change the return value of search to node pointer. So the public search cannot return a node pointer. The reason is because we declare node as a private inner class of our tree because node is a private inner class of our tree then node pointer is not going to be visible to outside the tree so then the user of our tree class will not be able to use search so what we need to do is we need to stick with boolean here but it is okay to reuse node pointer for the private search. The public search will return true only when the private search return is not a null pointer. Then just uh, that will be a simple uh, fix, and I will just return null ptr there. Right? And my private, oops. Oh, I don't have the code because I delete the code, right, from last time. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to fix that later because, I mean, this part has been recorded on my, on my video, right? Okay? Uh, so I don't have to worry about that part. I will do that later. Okay, so now, uh, at this point, I mean, just return current position, which is incorrect. But my, my focus now is on insert. So. What, what would be the return value that you want to use here? A Boolean or node pointer for insert? 
Boolean, OK. Why would you want Uh, let's say if you want to know the exact location, but it's not commonly practical to do that, okay? Because with insert, you just you don't really care about where the location is inserted, right? As long as you know it's part of, of the tree, okay? So let's just uh, stick with the boolean, okay? And again, I need to tell the insert, the private insert function, to start inserting from the root pointer, okay? What did I do wrong? Oh, PRT, yep. Okay. But notice when I insert, when I insert a new item, I have to insert whenever I found a nil, correct? But then that nil will get updated with a new address. Are you with me? When I search, in order to find the location, I need to search, I need to do a zigzag search until I find a nil, until I know that that new item has to be inserted either to the left or to the right of a node. Okay, as soon as, let's say, when I try to insert, let's say, use another one. Let's, if I try to insert nine, if I start to insert nine, I start from here, continue searching left, continue searching right, I know that nine has to be inserted to the as the right child of eight. What I need to do is I need to allocate a new node, but then I need to update that pointer from now to a new node address. Right? Are you with me still? <laughs> that means the second parameter of my insert must be a reference. Okay, but the reference is a reference to a pointer. I know this might be confusing to you. Aww. Okay, I was just trying to get pointers and references <laughs> just by myself. Just ignore <laughs> that for now. What if you have to update a float? When you have to update a float, then you will pass a float reference. What if you have to update a rectangle? You need to pass a rectangle reference. Okay, so. What, you are ha what here, what you need to update is a pointer. So that's why you see the star and the ampersand together. But remember, the goal is being able to update a nil into a non-nil when you return. Yeah. So what, are, are you passing the, that if you call that function with a nodes pointer, <laughs> mm -hmm. or the, the nodes left or right, mm -hmm. is it referring back to that pointer, even though yeah. it's passing a, yeah. a null? Yeah. OK. Yeah, that makes sense. So remember, no, this is an alias, right? <coughs> Post is just as al an alias, mm -hmm. OK? When you start from here, when you start from a blank tree, from an empty tree, post is just an alias to your root pointer, root PTR, just an alias, OK? As you continue doing the zigzag, 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 let's say you are here, let's say you are here. Now, post is just an alias <coughs> to that box. Remember, a reference is just an alias, okay? We don't create, we don't create a copy, but we are just calling that box <coughs> post now. Yes? It's, a, it's an alias to the box, or is it the whole node? Al an alias to that small box. An alias to that small box, okay? So when you start searching from the top, from the root, post is an alias to that entire box, okay? And then here, when you decide to branch left or right, let's say you decide to branch right, post is now just an alias to that small box, not to the, to, not to the entire node, okay? So then here, again, when you decide to continue to branch left, again, post is just an alias to that small box. Just we are giving a new name. That's the concept of an alias, right? You're not copying anything. You're just naming a, an existing object with your own name. Yes? Uh, so each node, does it have three addresses? Each node, what is the question again? Do we, does each node have three different addresses? Nope, only two. So the structure of a node, the middle part is data, okay? And <coughs> uh, left pointer and right pointer. So we have like, uh, 
So your question is the address, uh, well, remember reference is not address, right? Yeah, yeah reference and address. Reference is a new name <coughs> for something, right? An alias for something. Yes? Um, is, is, does the alias change? Because you're, you're, once you have the alias assigned, it kind of change, correct? So is it because it, you're calling it recursively? Okay, uh, let me, the alias cannot change within the context of a block, okay? Inside a block, when you have an alias for a variable, you cannot use the same alias to name another object within the context of a block. <coughs> but remember, what you're going to do here is we're going to make a recursive call, right? So recursive call is a different context. Right. Yes. So okay. Like every time you're referring to like a root PTR, the alias, it's a new root PTR. A new time. block, and you're using the same name for naming a different different part of your tree, basically. Okay, so that is important, okay? So once you understand that, then uh, basically then uh, how, do you, how, do you de how do you know that it is time to insert now? When pause is now, right? Pause is now, I know this is the time, the, the correct place to insert, okay? So then what I need to do is, I need to just declare an, a new node, right? Okay, and I need to place uh, uh, data, I need to place a key into my data, and I need, to dec I need to reset left and right to null. Left is equal to pose, pose right equals to null. Okay? Question. What's the v hyphen We need a hyphen there for all the arrows left. Post left needs to be on the left side of the argument. Oh, sorry. Okay. So, else, what do you do? If the pointer is not now, then you need to decide whether to insert to the left or insert to the right. Right? Okay. So then we need, just need an if statement. If uh, the item, the key that we are trying to insert is less than the data at the current node, the current node is uh, pointed by post, by post, okay? So then I need to insert to my left. So then I just continue searching, continue inserting, I say, I should say. But this time <laughs> I need to continue inserting to my left. Okay, else if key is bigger than the current data, then I need to continue inserting into my right. Okay, and under else, I have a duplicate condition here. Yeah. Okay, good. Yes. Second key is up, yep. Kai. Yep. Question. So do we have to determine that our <coughs> template is of a comparable type? Or is that yes. Yes. Yep. Um, yep. Uh, you see that um, because of that, because of the comparison that you do, remember we are trying to compare Z, right? We are trying to compare a Z. Uh, a, uh, something of type Z using less than, that means whatever Z requires to overload the less than. And will that be detected by the compiler or should we maintain that? The compiler, if you try to use the, the tree for a rectangle, for instance, if your rectangle doesn't have the less than, doesn't have the greater than <laughs> overloaded, it will give you a compiler. Okay. Yes. Why do you have two insert methods again? One is private with two parameters, yep. and one is public with one parameter only. Okay. The reason is because from the point of view of the of the user, you don't really the root pointer is hidden, right? The root pointer is just an internal structure. Okay. 
Okay, imagine from the point of view of the user, what I what I care is just, hey, I want to insert a new string into your tree. I don't really care where you start inserting. Okay. Right? That's why the public the public view is only insert with one item. Oh, okay, I see. Right? So the user just wants to input yeah. what they want. So whenever you are trying to insert, you're going to use that insert with one parameter, not insert with two parameters. So if you are the main user, you use insert with one parameter. Yes. Yes. Okay. The reason why we have to use two parameters here is because the way we branch left and right, because we have to be able to continue whether to follow right or to follow uh, right, uh, left leg. Okay. Okay. Oh, so those are left pointers. Those are return constants. Yeah. Okay. So those are left pointers. Yes. So is a pointer. Yes. So close to us left. Is a pointer. Post left is a pointer. Yes. But it's asking for reference to a pointer. Yes. It still work? Yep. It is a, okay. Think of that as an alias to a pointer, right? Think of that as an, as an alias to a pointer. If you look up on the higher leg code, it's being passed as a pointer because the node is a pointer. Yeah, because we start from here. Well, you scroll up, you can, actually, you can see the type agreement. What type? Because the nodes are declared as pointers, so they have to pass this pointer just to keep what you're trying to use. Yeah, yeah. Because the root pointer is a pointer to a node. Yeah. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. 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 The root pointer is a pointer. You're passing pointer, not passing value. That's why it's node pointer reference. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Makes sense in my head. I'm gonna forget later. Any <laughs> any question? Any other further questions? Okay, so now pointer is a reference is an alias to something, alias to an object, alias to a pointer, alias to a float, alias to whatever. Okay, 